Hello everyone, welcome into my kitchen. Today I'm gonna to make you kebab chenjelari. Lar or Laristan is in uh, southwest of Iran by Persian Gulf. The kebab they have is absolutely tasty and there is nobody, nobody going there and not having kebab chenjelari. It is one of the nicest and one of the tastiest kebabs you can find. Today we're gonna to make that with beef. The ingredients we need are going to be yogurt, and that is concentrated yogurt, black peppercorn, sea salt, and that is coarse sea salt, white peppercorn, coriander seeds, smoked paprika. I'm going to start from spices. For two pounds of beef, we're gonna use quarter teaspoon of coriander seeds, quarter teaspoon of white peppercorn, quarter teaspoon of black peppercorn, half a teaspoon of salt, quarter teaspoon of paprika. Now we're gonna pound everything. I'm gonna cut all of them to the same thickness, like about half an inches. Now I'm gonna pound the meat, and the best thing to do is always you wet your meat a little, so it's not gonna stick to your pounder. It is always good idea to have a little bit of fat in your kebab, because the actual extra fat gonna make the kebab a lot nicer and tastier. I'm gonna cut them to a smaller pieces, now I'm going to dry the meat. It is much better when you dry that and when that is totally dry, there is no moisture or no water on it. We also need one diced onion. As you see, I always keep the bottom part of the onion, so when I'm chopping it, it can stay all together. Now I'm going to add the spices. Also zest up one lime. Two large tablespoons of yogurt, and as I said this, yogurt is homemade and that's concentrated. Mix all and store it in the fridge. Let it marinate for 24 hours. As I said, you should really store it in the fridge for 24 hours for the best result. That is how you're gonna get the kebab nice, tender, tasty, and beautiful. And I'm sure you don't wanna wait one whole day for me to make another video and show you how it works. That is why yesterday I've already cut a marinated one batch and it's ready to be a skewered. Now I'm gonna eat that tomorrow. If you want, you're welcome to come and join me and have some kebab. This kebab is so tasty, so tasty. You can even eat the meat raw like this. I mean, I know some people probably they don't like it, but the taste is so good and it gives you the feeling of it's already cooked. From two pounds of beef, we got five skewers of chenjei lari. Also some grilled vegetable gonna go quite well with this dish. I'm gonna have a skewer of miniature bell peppers. Also a skewer of tomatoes. Our grill is nice and hot. It is red hot as you see. 
Now it's the time to start grilling. What I do, I'm gonna put the vegetable first. This is the salad dressing I showed you. That was the, that was my over 20 year secret. I showed you a few videos uh, back and it is excellent. It's excellent with grilling any vegetable. As I mentioned, kebab lari is one of the tastiest and one of the most desirable kebabs you have ever had. People, they love it. People, they love it. Yeah, we do make a lot of chenje with yogurt, but we never make chenje with concentrated yogurt. As you see, it is on the kebab, and when I'm grilling it, oh my God, the meat melts in your mouth. It is so tasty. You should really try that at home. You're gonna love it. Also, I would like to thank you for watching my videos and supporting my channels. If you have not subscribed, please just click on that corner on that red button and subscribe to my channel and give us a thumbs up at the bottom of this video here. The bottom, please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to share these videos with your friends and family. And I hope you are enjoying it. And I'm sure they will. No tea today. Zora is decorating the tray for the meat. I'm rubbing some butter on the kebab. And definitely the kebabs are grilled to perfection. It's good. It is it is good. It is absolutely perfect. And you make some Shirazi salad. He made it. Behind the scenes he made it. So it's good. And this food is over this I don't know what to do. Cry or eat. <laughs> Let's see. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm. Oh. 
Oh my god. It's so tender. Oh, I don't know which one I should try. Do you want some bread? Oh yeah, please. This food is extraordinary. I tell you, you should really try that. You should make it at home. And it was easy, not very and hard. It is easy, you saw. Marinating took about 10 minutes, 15 minutes, including cutting the beef and everything. Overnight, in the fridge, no problem, you can do that. But you're gonna enjoy the dish, you're gonna enjoy the kebab. It melts on your tongue and the taste is, ah, it is good. We hope you enjoyed watching this video. Again, please don't forget to share the video with your friends and family and give us a thumbs up right at the bottom of the video. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe to our channel. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you. See you next time. See you. See you.